I'm here with Michael Hope. He's the Lenaro tool, tool Chain Tech Lead, and we're at Lenaro Connect here in Orlando, Florida. Michael, can you tell viewers a little bit about what you do for Lenaro? Yep. So inside the Tool Chain Group, we do everything related to Tool Chain. Uh, many low-level things such as compilers, debuggers, profilers, uh, system trace. Uh, we've been working recently mostly on uh, the GNU C compiler, GCC, and GDB and QMU. Those are our primary outputs, but uh, we do everything tool chain. In the, in the past, we've looked at uh, other tracing tools, and in the future, we might branch out into things like uh, LLVM, and who knows? It's very exciting, and it's exciting for developers to hear what you all are doing. How can developers get involved with what you're doing? Yeah. The good thing is if you're using recent Ubuntu, you already are. So uh, Lenaro GCC was picked up by Ubuntu and it's used in the latest Lenaric release both on ARM and on x86 so you're already getting those performance improvements. The GDB and QM are already there. We're looking in the short term for end developers uh, to supply binary tool chains that you can pick up and use in Windows and uh, uh, generic Linux. So if you're an end developer, you've got a couple of ways of picking it up. Um, even source distributions such as uh, OpenWT already include our products. The other way around, we, uh, we'd love input, would love uh, especially performance areas which we focus on, uh, routines that you've written yourselves or areas that you've seen GCC have trouble in, or even hard debugging problems that you've run across and uh, uh, we can look at them in the future. So would people go to lenaro.org to find out how they need to get involved or where where on the internet can, can they go to find you yep. or find your team to get involved with that? Yep, so start off at uh, lenaro.org, that's the uh, the more company-like landing page, but also have a look on wiki.lenaro.org. There's lots of good links there on how to get a hold of us. Uh, that'll take you through to the Lenaro Dev emailing list and uh, yeah, send us an email. Great, so you mentioned that if you're already using Ubuntu, you're already using some of these using the tool chain in that. Mm -hmm. What is the the collaboration between Canonical and Lenaro in terms of the tool chain? Oh, I'm, I'm really happy with it. Uh, so Ubuntu pick up our tool chain and it's a two-way thing. So we get all of the benefit of uh, having our tool chain used in a big real product. There's nothing like having the thousands and thousands of packages that Ubuntu has run through our compiler to make sure it's correct, make sure it's fast. And Ubuntu gets uh, advantages as well. They get uh, somebody they can ask um, specific queries about and they get all the performance improvements that we're doing. It's pretty exciting for those of us who use Ubuntu and who are big fans of ARM and the embedded space. Mm. And so to see it all come together, it, it's pretty exciting, even if it's at that low level um, uh, developer you know, tool chain area that, that, you, that you're involved in. Is there anything else that I haven't asked you about um, in regards to Lenaro Connect or UDS or the tool chain that, that you'd like to speak about now? It's just good to have all these people here and to have so many interesting hallway conversations. You, you never really know what you're going to run across or how long it's going to take you to get from uh, one room to the next. It, the hallway tracks are amazing, <laughs> that, that is are. true. Michael, thank you so much for taking time to sit down and talk with me, and I look forward to seeing the, the future of Lenaro and, and all the interesting and exciting developments that mm. you and your team do throughout this next cycle. Thank you.